What's up, Buffalo Nation? Jaime, the ambush are out. It was a massive success uh, whenever they got released. I'm super excited. Uh, everybody's been commenting, wanting a review to come out. So here it is. Yeah, bro, I'm excited just as well. We're also gonna announce a winner from our last video and also have another giveaway on this video. So stay tuned for details. Hey, what's up, Buffalo Nation? It's Raul. Hey guys, it's Jaime. We're here at the Buffalo headquarters. So today, we're gonna do the much anticipated um, review of the Ambush Bag series, Jaime. The Ambush Bags, like I said, it comes in the silver, white, and black. The speed side, slow side, we're looking at a seven. Then the fast side, we're looking at a nine. So it's gonna be one of your, pretty much, it's gonna be for your fast throwers, just like ourselves. I mean, not really far as blocking. It's really gonna be, I, I don't wanna say impossible, but it's gonna be hard to block with this bag. So I have noticed, cause we've thrown this a bunch of times. So, I mean, this bag is built for us. Right. I mean, we, we, we want this bag to be our next bag. And this is gonna be our next bag. Uh, this, this series, Ambush, um, it's not for the blockers, but when you get on a sticky board, that slow side, it's a seven, right. but it's, it'll, it'll stop for you, you right. know, if you absolutely want to. I, just like any bag, you know, if you want to put the blocker there, you have to put it there. Oh, With yeah. this one, it's obviously a little bit harder because it is a faster bag. Right. Um, so once you break it in, how does it feel? Oh, I mean, like I said, I mean, you, everybody knows us as throwers. We're more of a finesse thrower. So I think this bag fits our game perfectly. Our game, as far as everybody knows us as, I mean, knows you more of a, a stronger airmail. Myself, it helps me on my slide around shot. Oh yeah. I mean, that's my go-to shot whenever, uh, whenever, I, I, whenever I am playing somebody that likes to block, I rely on that slide around shot. And this is the bag that's gonna do it. It's they're fast, even on the slow side, I rarely, personally, I rarely throw on the slow side, but with this bag, I throw on the slow side. That's how fast it is. Even with the slide around shot, you can do it on both sides, fast and slow side. You know, it's interesting that you say that because I myself do that. I, I throw on the slow side. And so that kind of gives you an indication of how good this bag is. Right. Because even with the seven speed, it's still fast enough for us. Right. Because, I mean, mm -hmm. we used to throw those really fast bags. Yeah. Um, the fast side is just that. It's, it's very fast. And, I mean, it cuts through anything. You know, sticky boards, humidity, anything that that Texas weather can bring us, oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, it's gonna go right through it. Um, and we've seen it firsthand. Right. I mean, we put it through the paces. I mean, sticky, humid, cold, wet, I mean, oh, yeah. everything. Absolutely. I mean, we've gone through the whole work. We've put many materials together, trying to find the one perfect one that was gonna fit our game. Um, and not, not to say, like I said, I'm not saying this is the best, but this this is the best for us. Yeah. This, is, this is what, we feel that's gonna give us a better opportunity to win and be successful, be success, successful in, in, a, in every match that we play in. So the great thing about Buffalo Boards and obviously working here um, is, is Billy is kind of like a mad scientist, right. you know? I mean, we went through, I don't know how many different sets, and oh, I'm yeah. talking about different yeah. sets with 10 to 15 types of fabrics. Yeah, you know? the trial and errors. Um, and he was just like, do you like it? No? All right, yeah. let's do another one. Let's do another right. one. Let's do another one. And we were like, okay. And so this is one of our, our one of our last ones, actually. Yeah. I mean, we went through the whole, <laughs> <laughs> all the fabrics that we could muster and come up with. This was actually probably one of the last ones. Right, yeah. And, um, and it was a good thing because, I mean, we had that practice going forward. Yeah. You know, we, we knew exactly the fast side we wanted. I think it was just the slow side that, that really had us held up. Oh yeah, you know? yeah. Because I mean, like you said, me personally, I don't really throw on the slow side. But this bag, more likely, I will be throwing on the slow side. That's how fast this bag is going to be, especially on a fast board. I mean, we've played it on a sticky board, and it's still, yeah, we got to throw a little bit harder, but it still does the job that we want it to do. It yeah. still slides. It doesn't have any kick, or it doesn't just kind of hit the board and flop over. I mean, it pretty much. Like, like you mentioned uh, just a couple minutes ago that on any type of board, any type of weather that Houston has for us, I mean, this bag's gonna be our number one bag. Yeah. I, think, I think the great thing about this bag is, 
I'm gonna go on record saying this, that this bag is a loose bag. Right. It's a fast bag. Yep. And so there's definitely a, a, a category, right. you know, in the ACL or, or just in Cornell in general. So you have your loose bags, your fast bags, your fast bags, your medium fill, all that, your carpet throwers. In this category, I think this will, this will be the best bag, the best fast bag on the market. Oh, I agree. And, I agree. And maybe, you know, I'm, I'm not being biased. <laughs> maybe I am a little bit, but well, I mean, from beginning to end, we had our hands on this right. the whole time. And so from the fabrics, from the feel, from, um, you know, just the design. Yeah. I mean, we had every input and that's what makes it special for us. Right. Yeah. You know, I mean, we literally from the beginning to the end saw it all the way through. Oh, yeah. Like you said, this bag fits perfect. I mean, this bag, the flimsiness that we like. Not too many people like the flimsiness like we do. I mean, that's one thing that we get told every time they fill our bags. It's like, oh, wow, there's a flimsy. Those right. are real loose. I mean, that's like the first two things people tell us when they fill our bags. So once these bags get broken in, I mean, they're going to feel like that. But I, I mean, to your point, though, I mean, whenever you throw a bag like this, that's exactly what you want. Right. You want that sneak around yeah. shot. You want that, that shot where you have you know, a block that's kind of halfway in the hole and you can easily go around right, with this right. bag. Oh, yeah. Any other bag, you're taking that other bag, bag with, with you, you. Right. you know? And so that's the advantage with this bag. Obviously there's different types of advantages all yeah. over the place, but um, you know, this bag is, is special to us yeah. because like I said, I mean, from beginning to end, we developed this bag the way we wanted and um, it's something special for us, so. Oh yeah, like have you seen it, man? You've seen how this this bag is another thing, like you mentioned, just to slide around. This bag is real hole friendly. Time this bag's around the hole, any vibration, this bag's gonna fall in. I mean, you've seen it. We've both seen it up, up close, up personal. So, I mean, and that's what we want. This this bag probably is the most hole friendly bag I've ever thrown. Oh, absolutely. And I've thrown them all <laughs> as far as the fast bags are concerned. Yeah. We've thrown them all. And this is probably the most hole friendly bag that you'll get. Oh, I yeah. guarantee it. Absolutely. absolutely. I mean, like I said, there always, everyone's going to see how, how perfect this bag is and how, how hole friendly. I mean, that's like the main thing that I can say about this bag, that it, it is real hole friendly. So as soon as they see that, I mean, that's just going to be instant. Yeah, they're going to fall in love with the back. Right. I mean, all it has to do is just touch that hole. Yeah, touch, touch the, the hole and it's going in. Yeah. So, I mean, that's a different from three point to one point. Oh, I yeah. I mean, it's, it's just, it's, it'll, it doesn't sound, sound like a lot, lot but it, it, it'll come, it, it'll come into play. It's right. going to come into play and it'll be a big factor and it'll give you an advantage. And the thing too, like you said, your, one of your main strengths is sliding around. Right. A lot of people, once they have that blocker there, they, almost think, okay, block or go straight air mill. Right. Now you have a third dimension that you can do, which is slide around. Yeah. Either or, you can go left or you can go right, depending on what side of the board you're on. And so this this bag gives you that dimension. Right. I mean, even other fast bags can't do that. Yeah. You know, once they touch that hole, they'll still kind of stick up, you know. This bag does not do that. I mean, it doesn't kick. Yeah, it doesn't, doesn't kick. It does yeah. not kick. I mean, we don't have the flattest bags and, and they don't kick for us. Right. Um, Slow side or fast side, they yeah. don't kick. Oh yeah, so, like you said, I mean, it's gonna slide around and it's flimsy enough where it slide around and it's gonna leave that bag there. It's, it's not for all types of throwers, but for the thrower that likes this type of bag, guys, I guarantee you that y'all are gonna love this bag. And I hope y'all do as much as we do. What's up guys? We're gonna go down and back a couple of times with the new ambush bags. Uh, you'll hear our dialogue, see what we really think about the bags. Uh, and here we go. Feel really great in the hand. I mean, these are the bags that we're gonna throw initially. So, I mean, we, we absolutely love the feel of these bags. Love the feel, love how hole friendly they are. Well, not that one. We're hole friendly, hole forgiven. Uh, at the same time, like I said, they are they are fast. I mean, I know, I think this round, every every bag we threw was all slow side. Yeah. I mean, slow side is still fast yeah. enough. You can see how fast, fast it is slow side. I mean, 
I imagine all those times with the fast side, like maybe two or three of them probably would have went off the board. Yeah, I mean, you also have to realize too, like these boards are fast. I mean, they're in a perfect condition, which means no humidity, no, no temperature change, no nothing. So these boards are fast. Yeah. Wanted to see you try to put a block down, see how. <laughs> yeah, blocking probably won't happen with these bags. Nah. You try to put a block, it's gonna slide right off. I mean, all right, I'll start this round off. Name of the game, game is just going in the hole. We're gonna go slow side again. As you can see, yeah, like I said, we're a hole friendly. See, that's what that bag does right there. That bag is, is what, 25% in the hole? Oh yeah. And I went, I mean, I went that side of the hole and it just slipped in. This is yeah. what that bag can do for you. That's, that's a great, great image right there. Yeah. We're gonna try to go fast side so we can get a little help on the drag, which now I don't need to, but we're gonna just. Yeah, see? Now, yeah, pinched. All right, see the little bully slow side. Hmm. Ah, I missed it. Oh! And the drag. Help. Good back. That was gonna get some help. <clears throat> you still throwing slow side if you swap if you No, I mean <laughs> on these boards I, I don't think I can throw fast. I mean it's almost suicidal, but I mean, like I said, on, on sticky conditions, you throw that fast side, it's perfect. Yeah. And there it goes again. Yeah, just left it right there. Wow, pinched it again. <laughs> this is just like last round. <laughs> yeah, it was the same. <laughs> So what do you think about the feel? I like the feel, I like the feel. Just gotta, like I said, gotta get used to the speed and I mean, not, we're not always gonna play on fast boards like this, but I mean, like I tell everybody, if you, if you can play on Buffalo boards, you can play on any board. All right, guys, uh, like I said, it's gonna be a last round. We're gonna throw this last round. Uh, just to give you an idea of what these bags can do. Obviously you see this, the slide around shots or the bag that slides in and able to leave a bag. I mean, that's something that you can use to your advantage against any opponent. Yeah, a lot of fast bag throwers really like that, obviously, and they know what we're talking about, so. I'll start this run off. That's what it does. Conclusion. That's what the ambush does right there. All right, Jaime, you ready to announce the winner? Yes, let's do it. All right, guys, so as promised on our previous video, we were doing a giveaway and we're here to announce the winner. Our first winner is Josh Benoit, and uh, he has won this Buffalo Boards hat. Congratulations, Josh. Our second winner is Corey Russell. He is the winner of the Buffalo Boards t shirt. Congratulations, Corey. We'll get with you to make sure we get the right size mode out to you. All right, so Jaime, on this video, what are we gonna give away? I'm happy to announce on this video, the giveaway will be a set of the ambush bags as well as a RJ patch. Just like the last video, in order to enter, you must be a subscriber to our channel as well as leave a comment below. Man, that's amazing, that's great. So we'll be, giving, uh, we'll be announcing the winner on our next video. Um, but for more information on the ambush, go to buffaloboards.com. Uh, thanks guys, and we'll see you next time.